ITV Tonight aired The End of Manhunt, the three-part series dramatizing the hunt for serial early by Belfield. Manhunt Ending explained how Colin Sutton, played by Martin Clunes, managed to get the evidence he needed to get Belfield convicted of two murders. The ITV drama ends with Levi Belfield, Selin Jones, getting charged with murder. What happened at the end of Manhunt? The episode picked up from where the last episode left off, with the police getting ready to arrest Levi Belfield with two journalists in tow, they break into the house he shares with partner Laura Marsh and can't find him, leading them to believe he has escaped. However, D.S. Norman Griffiths quizzes Laura, who says he is hiding in the attic, so the officers go up there and capture him. He has his first encounter with Colin Sutton, who Belfield calls OFP. They now have 72 hours to get the evidence from Belfield they need to convict him. Who is Colin Sutton? D.S. Joe Brunt, Katie Leon, and D.C. Gary Cunningham, Steve first, interrogate him, though he denies he owns the van seen in CCTV footage and he does not fall under their questioning. Hitting a dead end, Colin and Joe visit Laura again to try and find the evidence they need. She tells them of his domestic abuse against her and reveals Levi raped her close to where one of the crimes took place. This is enough to get him remanded without bail and he is sent to a prison in Milton Keynes, leading to Belfield having a tantrum in the magistrate's court. However, despite testimony from Laura, they still have no forensic evidence linking him to the murder. Where was Manhunt filmed and set? Colin is then visited at the police station by Laura, who says I want to talk about Millie Dowler. She revealed a number of details that had led Laura to believe he had dead the young woman, including the fact that he destroyed her duwoo, the same duwoo that had been on CCTV. This revelation puts him at odds with the team investigating Dowler's death, who want to chase their own suspect, leading to a shouting match between Colin and the Surrey Police's D.S. Steve Scott, Howard Ward. D.S. Nicola Hart came to visit Colin with her evidence on Sarah Knight. Hannah Ray, leading to the discovery of new CCTV footage that had not been watched. This CCTV footage provides the smoking gun they need, with Levi's car seen on the footage following Sarah's bus. Manhunt air date, cast, trailer, but Colin then travels to France to personally apologize to the parents of Mealy de Lagrange who, if the CCTV footage had been discovered previously, would still be alive. Joe then has a thought that the supermarket Laura said she visited when she thinks Levi was in Dowler will still have the receipt that proves her story, which they then find. We then cut ahead to Levi being charged for the murders of Amelia and the attempted murder of Sarah Knight. Manhunt then ends with captions saying that Levi was eventually also charged with the murders of Marsha McDonnell and Millie Dowler. Manhunt is available to watch on ITV Hub now.